Did you know every time you launch your browser and log in, say your Google account, there could be a malicious extension secretly monitoring everything you enter? These malicious extensions have the capability to not only steal email and passwords, but also other sensitive information like your credit card info or even your social security numbers. They can also transmit this data to external servers. Interestingly, they need only the basic permission to run on a website to do so. Previously, browser extensions were caught siphoning off sensitive data. For example, an extension was caught stealing private keys from crypto wallets. In another instance, McAfee researchers discovered an extension inserting malicious cookies into user sessions. Malicious actors have also taken advantage of open source extensions, such as uBlock Origin, exploiting them to extract user data. Also, it's not uncommon for malicious entities to acquire reputable extensions only to push malicious code through updates. To gauge the scope of the problem, we examined approximately 160,000 extensions from the Chrome Web Store using both static and dynamic analysis. We then applied a large language model framework to identify potentially malicious data flows within these extensions. We also conducted an analysis on the login pages of the 10,000 most visited websites to, to determine if password values are accessible via malicious extensions. Our investigation led to a surprising discovery. Several well-known websites, including popular sites like Google and Cloudflare, were found to store user-entered passwords in plain text right in the website's source code. Our goal is to inform people about online threats that might seem harmless but can actually lead to significant privacy risks. Our research into how browser extensions access sensitive data has been recognized and featured by major news outlets, including TechRadar, The Mirror, The Sun, Malwarebytes, and Bleeding Computer, as well as coverage by our, our local TV station. Since our research, we have seen a positive trend. One example is the IRS's website now securing SSN data. To learn more about our findings and the implications for online privacy, please check out our paper, Experimental Security Analysis of Sensitive Data Access by Browser Extensions, at the Web Conference 2024.